Alright guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin 2. Do not steal. I'm gonna just walk through this, I don't even give a fuck. Um, yeah, let's just throw this somewhere else. Get out of here. Fuck. It's getting worse all the time. Now I'm actually on fire. It's fuck. fine, I can just... How did I get past this last time? I think we fucking went the uh, other way. What? Maybe she has to be a lead, because she can actually see traps? Uh... You know, uh, I don't judge traps. Also, I'm gonna go open these, because I don't think we opened these yet. Also, why do I see bodies on the ground, like, permanently? Oh, where? Like the mop over there? No, I can see these on the ground. No, that's not the... I guess this, this guys are just dead here. Like, it... Drac... Yeah, but... This corpus do exist. Fuck. We lost. Hey! No, but like I, I, they have a yellow outline for me, all the time. Oh, like constantly. It's weird. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I didn't think there was an option for that. I'm trying to see. Like, did I turn something on that I wasn't aware of? Holly character's grave. What is the grave key? That's that's the thing beside number one, right? <laughs> I don't know what the grave key is. I, I, I really don't actually. I think it is. Let me, let me actually see. <laughs> you're the programmer. Yeah, it is. I mean, it's not the, that it's is not the tilde key. What do you mean you're the programmer? I don't fucking know. To... Yeah, it's a tilde. I guess that's a grave character. Oh, hi, TF. I thought, I thought, fire skill book. I thought that I thought that button was called back quote. Actually, that's what I thought. Uh, that's what I always called it. But hey, can call... I quote you on that? Back quote? Yeah, sure. I don't know if I'm wrong though. Yeah, okay, so that's not the... I don't know why it's fucking whatever, but yeah, okay, fine. So Bill will lead the charge. I mean, there's some gold there and some bullshit, but... Um, I mean, what, are we just supposed to, like, just kill the fucking... So everyone in the sawmill? Oh yeah, we went across this thing before, I remember now. Oh yeah, there was a, uh... There was a shrieker, and then we... Decided it was level 15, therefore, uh, too spooky. <sighs> Yeah, like we came here and like we just the right. The, oh look, spirits of dead people. Oh cool. Look out! Stay away from me, you lone wolf tosser. We're uh, <laughs> lone wolf tosser. You know, uh, tell me you know the uh, lone wolf. Likely story, wolf. Go on, piss off. Watch your mouth or else. Else what? You lone wolves kick the shite out of me and send me into an accursed minefield where my cart gets blown up and I get killed and all you can do is laugh. <laughs> Nothing you can do is worse than that. Sure, I'm concerned this very <laughs> short. So do you get special dialogue with Ethan? Why <laughs> didn't tell him you're no lone wolf? Uh, oh, fuck it. Let's see what we can tell him. He'd better be, he'd be wise to take a more respectful tone with the silver claw. Oh, is that supposed to scare me? You all have those ridiculous names. The Wayward Owl, the Fidgety Lavender, the Overturned Bucket. Your <laughs> lone wolf brothers kick the shite out of me and send me into an accursed minefield where my cart gets blown up and I get killed and all you can do is tell me to have more respect. <sighs> Ectoplasm, gross. Nothing you can do is worse than that. Well, you can snack up, I don't care. Nah. The ghostly elf stands protectively over his corpse, eyes darting across the minefield. His gaze never quite falls on you. Reach into his mind. You are a warrior, proud and true. You saw your people die as the death fog consumed the forest. You heard them scream and then fall silent. You came for revenge, and you found your own death. All right. Are we just gonna just kind of just head on through? I guess. I guess so. Yeah, I guess there's really nothing else for us to do here. The prince coming? Whatever. He'll find his way. Actually, there is... Oh, these people are... Uh, they're not enemies, actually. Oh, they will be. Uh... Fuck. 
I was gonna just fly over this, but yeah. Let me do the talking. Yeah, yeah but I'll, oh, I'll yeah. let you do the talking. How about that? You go do the first, I'll go do the looting. <laughs> uh, gold. A lot of gold. Holy shit! Oh, you got you had lucky charm. The fuck? I think it's on a necklace I have. Okay. Knockdown arrow, rain scroll, and more gold. Fuck. Oops. That's not that's not shame pinging. All right. All right. Go do the talking. Hello, friendly humans. Company. Alright, the Grim Praise Guard raises weapon as you approach, then stops a short uh stops short and quickly bows, res bows respectfully. Continue. You've been missed, as I live and breathe. Didn't think we'd be seeing you again so soon, sir. Ask him if Roost Amlon is within. He is. He'd be glad to see you too. Glad as Roost gets anyway. <laughs> this guy's name is Pig's Ben. He's open you'll bring. Friends. He winks at you so hard and so theatrically that one whole half of his face seems to squint. Uh, no, I nodded and just moved past him. I don't want to know who he is. Roost's upstairs in the big house there, sir. He's waiting for you. Reckon he's as eager to hear how you've been uh, getting on as the rest of us. Alright. Stow your weapons, we don't want any trouble. I'm slowed, the fuck? Slowed by what? Oh, there's an oil patch there. Alright, well, this is, uh, I guess your place. Why, why did it look like there was an enemy here before? What the fuck happened? Cause it just looked like it to you? I mean, uh, they were red. They were red at the time that we looked at it last time, I think. Yeah, exactly. We were like, we didn't want to fight that. Oh, dude, snake root. Oh, shit. Lizard bitches. Can they save real quick? Uh... Are you trying to steal from your fucking own people? Not stealing per se, but there's something up here, like Firewater staff next to Firewater. Did you ever take this, bro? Nice. It doesn't give a shit, alright. I mean, what, did it have a thing on there saying it? No, it wasn't stealing, but like, I just figured like, it's... It's uh, like the guy's staff, and he's standing right next to it. I, I mean, I guess it's not stealing. Alright, lead us to glorious victory. Yeah, so this is the Mummy terrorist? I yeah, that's the person we saw last time, and she looked like she was hostile, so we're like, yeah, fuck this place. <sighs> a compact, heavy muscle dwarf uh, turns from her training. She flicks her wrist, and instantly her axe and stunning elven weapon is a hair, uh, hair's width from your chest. The blade sings. Marvel the beauty of the axe. Ask that's fresh blood on the, dip on the blade. She gives you a long look, then relaxes. The blade moves back an inch. Maybe you should read this shit. Oh, whoops. Uh, <laughs> I accidentally uh, turned up the dialogue. The blood belongs to the original owner and adds character. I look forward to adding Godwoken blood to the mix. The fuck? Oh, wow. Hmm. Ask who's put the contract out on Godwoken. Mind your own business, mate. Wow. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Note that a weapon is not normally meant to taste its owner's blood. It will if you swing it at me. Especially if you're an elven raider with more enthusiasm than skill. Ask if you can try the axe. No, you can't. I can sell you all manner of weapon, elven or not, if you have the gold. But this axe ain't for sale. Well, let's see what she has. Ah, uh, okay. Why are you shame pinging? The board. Fucking... Do that so I can go somewhere else. Christian dialogue. Just, uh, f fucking fine. Oh, I, was, I was checking the. Oh, hey! Oh, God, a shield! Oh, that's nice! Uh, push the weapon I away. You're gonna say note the dried weapon on the bottom of the blade. Well, I'm pretty sure we've already asked that. N did we? That belongs to the original yeah. elven uh, owner. Well, we kind of did. Okay, whatever, I'm gone. Yeah, good. The fuck? Burn. Would it be? Oh, there's a squirrel here. I have some lumpy giblets. The fuck? That came out of the squirrel. That came out of this. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, uh, dude. Strength glow? Dude, there's a oh, shit. Oh, there's a shield. Oh, dude, dude, dude there's, sh there's a shit ton of fabric dies. Okay, that shield is good, but it's actually not that good. It's not better than mine, but holy shit, it's good though. Alright, awesome. I, That's, I, you just steal all that? Yeah, I just stole all the fabric dyes that we'd ever need. <laughs> Put it on the lady benches before we fucking die! 
No, no, no. No, it's fine. Don't worry. Alright. What? How, do, how does... Oh, I guess you can't color armor? How the fuck do you use the... I, I actually don't know how to use dyes. How do we use dyes? I have no idea. You know what? I'm going to take my leave. If she turns around to haggle you, that's on you. Alright. I don't worry, I'm just running away. I'll work out. Although I do kind of want to steal all these chests. <laughs> I mean, you totally can. Oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, gone. oh shit. Allow the search. <laughs> oh shit, shit, no, 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 she's coming for me. <laughs> uh, allow the search. Uh, dude, I, I need to, I need to, fuck, why am I part of the dialogue? Alright, alright, right. you, you, need to, you need to help me out here. What do you need to do? You need to bring Red Prince, uh, out of here. Oh, dude, the characters in dialogue, I think we lost. No, I think, I, hang on, let me just, let can me you, just get my stealing can, can away. You, can you talk to her? Can you talk to her for a sec? Like, as soon as she's done with talking to Sabiel, because she's going to talk to me next. All right, you ready? Yeah. There you go. Okay, good. I'm, I'm just gonna send it all to Lady Vengeance. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking idiot. Wait, wait, wait. What, how am I? Why am I in dialogue right now? Still, the fuck. You're listening. You're listening in right, right now. Right, okay, I, I didn't have it on. All right, one sec. <laughs> Lady Vengeance. Lady Vengeance. Lady Vengeance. Lady Vengeance. Why do I have a Phoenix heart? The fuck. When did I get a Phoenix Heart? Who knows? But it's you look well, whatever, whatever happened to Freedom? Well, whatever happened to Freedom? Also, Are I, you I, good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good now, I think. Yeah, no, wait one sec, one more thing. Sorry, I, I had a little bit more black dye on me. Actually, I should auto-sort by last picked up. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're Gucci. Alright. Let me just say, just in case. Here you go. It's already over, probably. Yeah, go. You don't seem like the criminal I'm looking for, but you're still a criminal! What? What did you do? Wait. <laughs> what did you steal? That's nothing. Well, I sold the chest, but they're not on me. I put them in the Lady Vengeance. Wait, how did, how, but what did you say before that? Just allow the search. You it's don't like, seem to be the criminal. You don't I'm seem looking... like a criminal, oh, I guess you, but I'm going to attack you anyway. Because you had something stolen on you, I guess. No, I didn't. Trust me, uh, I just passed the checks. You checked my inventory. He's like, no, you haven't got anything. Oh, she, I, I mean, picked up the chests, put them both on Lady Vengeance. Uh, I'm just gonna attempt to bribe. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, I really don't want to attack. But she already asked you, didn't she? The fuck? Is wait, you're gonna attack her? I have no other option. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think so. Yo, what the fuck? All I wanted were dies. Why did the game I didn't end? think it was worth getting us arrested, bro. Yes, it was. You should have kept trying to bribe. Everyone has their I, price. I didn't have the option, Mike. Yeah, it did. It had another well, option there. I didn't. My option was attack. Really? What? Yeah, I had one option. It was, yeah, well, it's attack. Uh, that's not what I saw. That's what I saw. Trust me. Maybe you should have scrolled down. <laughs> yeah, scroll down for my one option. Yeah. Can you stop being casual? Can you stop stealing the die? Did you no. save, like, in the middle of that? I, I did. Alright, so, problem. Th Dude, no, 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 no. Like, I, I'm, I'm not joking. I saw, like, uh, uh, another bribe option. I'm not sure why you didn't see it. Maybe you could just press I only saw a bribe. I saw one bribe. I took it, and it's like, no, I'm not gonna take your bribe, cunt. I'm like, Let's fight now. Like, all right then. Okay, here, here's the thing. Oh, one second. Okay. Um. Okay, let me just make sure. Yeah, everything's gone. All right, let me see. We have good answer now. Let's take a look. All right. Yeah, I have four options and here. Looking, Attempt to bribe. You so found I tried an, last time. You found another. Okay. Attempt to bribe. Try it. But I haven't got anything on me. Whatever. I, I'm not sure. Another uh, evidence of another. Like the fuck. 
You, you must have something on you that's that has stolen on it. Oh, maybe it counts like something I put in Lady Vengeance? I don't know. Uh, I mean, the bribe didn't work. Do we just try it again? Yeah, just try it again. Oh, yeah, you're right. It is only attack. Alright, maybe you should try and, like, do Aoife and fucking bullshit. Alright, fine, let's load it up. Maybe, maybe I should teleport you out of combat or something. Or actually, can't we just flee? <laughs> can't flee because we're surrounded by enemies. We have to be far enough away to flee. Yeah. Uh, whatever. I, th I think you had. I think you have something in your inventory that's stolen. That's the only reason. It's flagged as stolen. But like, she didn't you look at your inventory before? What the fuck? Like, she's my inventory. So, like the only things I picked up were the two chests, which I then stored on the Lady Vengeance. Maybe she saw you doing that. I doubt it, cause I was stealthed. Fucking, I don't and know. Stealth sneaking was not broken. So I don't know. How did she explain it? The, the first time she did. I don't know. Didn't see anything wrong in the second time, and then she's like, oh, you have shit. She found evidence of another crime. It's not very specific to that. Anyways, try to try to maybe uh, maybe, maybe use the EFAM line to uh, say say she's racist or something. <laughs> not the EFAM line, the human line. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, really? Remember, it's not going to work. I have persuasion of one. Uh, but I guess my memory is okay, so maybe it'll work. I don't know. Okay, fine. Well, I mean, I, I'm still just buffering in. Good answer. Let's take a look. I <laughs> like your evidence of one kind to find evidence of another. <laughs> uh, memory, human, skull. You're going to be accused because you're human. Oh. <laughs> you know when you're being tricked. Uh, okay, let me, let me think here. Let me think here. Just try to think of... Uh, an ability maybe we have. I was thinking of like teleporting you out of combat, but you're the only one with teleportation. Uh, yeah, dude. I don't. I don't know why he's doing that, dude. This has now nothing to do with the dies. Where's the Where's the save I had before this? Let me see. I I, I had a. You know what? I actually did have a save just outside. You didn't talk to her yet, though. Might as well take it. All right, fine. Dude, that's fucked <laughs> up, dude. That's that's so fucked up. <laughs> you did that for dies. Dude, come on. It's still worth. I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> all right. How about this time? You do all the stealing. Yeah, but the thing so. is, the, th the problem is, you have something on you that she finds. Uh, that no, no. She like trust me. She did the check last time. I was like, do you have anything on you? I was like, yeah. Just look. I'm like, oh, you're clean. And she went on. Stop right there, criminal scum. Like, the, the only thing I picked up with the chest, and the, the only thing I could think of is, like, maybe what it's in my stash it counts, but I doubt it. Or, like, maybe the gold, like, counts as stolen, but it, I don't fucking know. All, all I know is it's extremely important to get these dies, because I have to look fabulous. Okay, but also, if you're going to be stealing the dies, can you also steal the chests that are around? <laughs> what, what am I, your fucking personal thief? Of course I will. <laughs> That'd be beast. <laughs> also known as thief, also known as dwarf. <laughs> That's the rudest fucking thing to do in a D and D party, by the way. Refer to characters by their class or race. <laughs> like, hey, fucking thief, could come do this. Like, come, I have a name. Fucking D and D nerd. Hey, you started. You started calling my fucking character thief and. Dwarf. You know, you know, I tried making a fucking. Uh, I tried playing D and D one time. Oh, where is it? It's over here, right? Is right. this where you do your D and D anecdote? No, no, dude. You want to know the character I made? Careful. I've spotted a sure. trap. It was um, I made Zeus. Ah, oh, yes. Literally Zeus. I had like chromatic orb and some other bullshit. Where are you at? Oh, you're I'm buffering. Oh, you're, you're uh, taking that. I'm in now. Stuff. All right, yes, because you said what you Love saved. Fine. Yeah, because you asked me to. Good thing I asked. <laughs> Fuck, she's going to the dice. I can't steal her right now. Right, I'm coming in. I'll talk to her and pin her down. But anyways, I was, uh, so, so apparently, according to the Dungeon Master, I wasn't allowed to actually be a god, so instead I was a person. No, don't fucking talk to her when she's here. I'm going to talk to her in, like, uh, this way, but I guess I'll wait. It's the waiting that gets you. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> she's self-aware. Fuck it, just do it. Oh, wait, 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 no, now she moved. Good go. 
Alright, I'm gonna talk to her this way. Yeah, boy. Alright, I'm sending it all to Lady Vengeance. Whoops, I just gave you one of them, uh oh. I, I, dude, you're, you're fucking off. I can access my inventory from, from Beast. Okay. You're gonna want to send it to Lady Vengeance. You sent three to me! I, dude, I, it was a stack of them, man. What could I, I do? I send them back to you, you can put them in your chest, because I don't want them in my chest. Okay. Three. <laughs> I'm so mad. Alright. Is there a way to, like, easily see what's stolen? No, nope. there really isn't. Because I, 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 cause I know I know for me, I have, like, in, in my backpack for Sibyl, I have Jahan's stolen diary. <laughs> so I, I wonder if that means anything. I mean, well, you saw it there before. If they find something on you that's like, Hey, yeah, that's stolen. I know because I know. Alright, I'm gonna go steal some chests. The one's yeah. in this room, right? Well, there's some in this room as well. The fuck? Seriously? Oh my god, she's gonna be so fucking mad. I should get over it. Make sure you stealth first. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> stealth. Junk. Junk. Very important. Also, there's a guy sleeping, but I guess he doesn't see. No, he doesn't count as seeing it. Let me just teleport my fucking everything over. Right now, finish the dialogue. This again. Found evidence of another crime, though. Alright, I'm ready to end this dialogue, so whatever you're good. Alright, go. I'm innocent. Take your leave. Hmm, what the like <laughs> dies here before? Like, I don't know. Hey, was there an optional objective on this map? I don't uh, hmm. Is she gonna notice the dies or is she gonna notice the chest? I know she's just gonna notice nothing. She hit the ground. Is I'm going this way. A bold move. Oh fuck, a bench though? I actually have no idea what this is for though. Probably to chop wood or something. I'll do a log. Benching. A strange cold emanates from the log. The closer you get, the deeper the cold penetrates. Interesting log. Uh, hang on, maybe... Spirit vision. It's a ghost log! Oh, is it? Oh, okay, fine. A ghostly aura shrouds the log, along with a penetrating icy cold. Place your hand on the log. Bitter cold shoots up your fingertips, through your arm, shoulder, neck, and into your brain. Your whole body contracts with the aching freeze, and a voice sounds inside of you. See what I see. Feel what I feel. Look down. Uh, do as the voice says and look down. Where your feet should be, you see great gnarled roots disappearing to a mossy forest floor. As this log once was, you are an ancestor tree. As you examine yourself, you see the top of a small elven child's head as she approaches. She wraps her arms around you and rests her head against your great trunk. Remember with her. You pass her a memory. Once, you were her father. You pass her the softness you remember of her chubby cheeks. You pass her the warmth between you when you curled back to back to sleep. A tear trickles from the child's eye and onto your bark. She whispers that she loves you. She says she will come back tomorrow. You see? The child departs and night falls. You hear voices and the dull thud of axes. A human approaches you and pats your trunk. He raises his axe and... You see? You lie in pieces on the forest floor. Rough hands toss you into a cart and haul you away. Do you see? You see? You see what he does to me. You see he takes me from my life. You see he cuts me into parts. You make him pay. Uh, where do you find the culprit? Look, 
His bones lie buried in our sacred soil, but his spirit, his spirit, his spirit remains. Find him. Take from him what he takes from me. I show you where. Find him. I find peace then. I find peace when he is gone. So we just got a quest from a log. You know. Log in quest givers, you know. Yeah. Uh, where, where would the thing be? The black bull? Oh, that would be... Oh, no. That was not the place. Uh, Haneg, Jahan... The sawmill... Oh, the sawmill's observer. There he is, I think. Alright. I mean, that should be a relatively easy quest. I'm gonna go upstairs. Oh, shit. There's snacks for Sibyl here, but there's people here. Sibyl grabs you by the arm, her nails embedding themselves into your flesh. Uh-oh. That's him. That's Roost. The man who abducted me and sold me to the Master. This is it. He knows where the Master is. Uh, say you presume she wants to war with him. Tell her to go right ahead. My thanks. Oh boy. Sibyl walks up to Roost, a massive man who's looming over a small elf, his hair a tangle of matted knots. Scars upon scars cross every inch of visible flesh, from his hands to his gnarled face. Roost Anlon, I've come to ask you a question. His smile is nauseating. You'll have to give me a kiss first. That's a tongue, too. He laughs, the sound of a hiccuping demon choking on raw offal. How vile and petty a thing you are. Shut up. It's her I'm talking to. Permanently blind and tied up. Sibyl, I was wondering when I'd see you again. Knew the time would come after you broke Daddy's leash. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. Been wondering when the master's little pet would pick up my scent. <laughs> you know, you know, the real me wants to, wants to say, drive the needle through his head and be done with it, but... Should I, should I say, urge him not to take the bait? Because I think it's someone you want to talk to too, right? Yeah, it is. Urge her, urge her not to take the bait. He's trying to provoke her. I know. She winks at him. Let's try that again, shall we? Her casual dismissal of his insults seemed to unsettle him somewhat. Uncertainty sours his face. How about we just cut to the chase? You are searching for your master. I know where he is. Them's the cards we're holding, and I've got all the aces up my sleeve. A flash of the needle. With lightning speed, Sibyl spears his hand. He howls with pain. Strange. I see no cards whatsoever. The master. Where is he? <laughs> tell Sibyl you're pressed. You, I thought you'd go straight for the throat now. We'll go like, tell him it's probably best to uh, you play along now. Not that you have to. She twists the needle, making him squirm and scream. On the island! He's on the island with no name. Good boy. She removes the needle. Roost suckles his wound with thick, slurping noises. Where is the island? Tell me. Oh, I'll do you one better. I'll take you there. I'm going to beat you like I did before. I'm going to bleed and bind you. And what's left of you, no more than a battered bit of meat, I'm going to deliver to the master all over again. He'll be so glad to have his puppy back, even if she'll have lost some of her luster. Well, it looks like that you're not going to be able to talk to him. I hit him anyway. Alright. No, I was going to box! Oh, sorry, my bad. Oh, uh, dude, there's like Bruh. some fucking dogs here. Alright, so... Bruh. Oh, there's a, why is there a little boy in the fucking corner? The fuck? What is this? Kevin Spacey's house? Wait, what? Alright. Um, there's a black mirror in here. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Yeah, there is. I'm so mad I didn't get to sell my incarnate. Sorry, my bad. <coughs> I fucked up. Alright, what's the plan here? Um... Do I want to just like fucking arrow spray that one of the dog goes down? Probably, you probably kill them. Because yeah. they're quite big, so you probably get all the arrows into them. For you. Uh, I mean, I walked into that one. You kind of did. 
Yeah, you could do elemental arrowheads first, or would that be like a waste? Uh, actually, it's not a waste. Like, I, don't know what your, I don't know what your AP economy is like right now. Uh, it's, it's always good. Oh, yeah, just barely. Goodbye, come. doggo. Oh yeah, I got, I got, I got some returns. I, I, for, I forgot it does that. Got All some right. gains. I'm thinking of re, uh, tactical, tactical retreat. Yeah, for the haste. yeah. Well, tactical retreat mostly to get away from the situation. And I guess I can just uh, hit this guy with this. There you go. No. Oh. God, we lined up so well from Marksman's Fang. Oh uh, yeah, no, I know. We always do. I love it. So I guess fuck uh, your story then. I guess it's all about Sabil's story. <laughs> it's fine, I'm the champion of the arena. I get all the adoring fans. Uh, so I'll do that and I'll do an encourage. Can I whirlwind? I can. Yeah, lady's um, I'll leave Lady at that health, because I think you'll be able to kill her. Yeah. Well, no, she'll get a turn. Do I, I can end Lady if you want. I mean, you can do whatever you want. I don't give a fuck. I think you give some of a fuck. No, I feel like I... Like, it's fucking... You know when the Lady can hit is, like, Beast or Red Prince, and I think they can take a hit. Mm. To give Sabeel an extra 2-8, like... like Sabeel can just get an extra turn out of that. That's I mean, delicious. I guess not really. It's just like it's a basically a free a free kill. No one has to spend points on that, but it also gets some hits in. So, I mean, if you have AOE shit, that also works. Yeah, man, good job. I, I think I'll just whirlwind with the Red Prince. It's fine. I'm ready. You do what you want, because I controlled the situation. Okay. Well, now I don't know what to do. Thanks. Yeah, no problem. Uh, fuck, what do I even do? I guess I should just start going for the guys in the back then. Where's, uh... <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Oh, she ta she has oh, erratic right, the teleport, west. right. Yeah. Alright. Oh, I think you hit the NPC in the room. Did I? Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, say hello, say hello. Oh, my bad. It's fine, you can take a hit. It's fine. Wait, what? Oh, it hit your fucking person. Whoopsies. It's fine, right. nothing happened. <laughs> nothing happened, don't worry about it. There's actually nothing for me to do here. From this angle, so... Unless I can sky shot someone. No. I can, actually, I can sky Reactive shot Reactive shot! Ah, I got him. Uh, yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> <laughs> you jinxed it, now oh, you actually no. did that. <laughs> Atrophy, the fuck? Didn't you just use that on him? Yeah, I did, actually. But now I actually can't use my uh, weapons. Delay my turn. It's okay. Oh, good. Um, I'm gonna be able to clear that. I mean, don't worry about it. Never I, mind. I have Atrophy anyway. <laughs> What's to be, I was gonna see if I could clear it on you with a soulmate, but no fucking... No, don't, don't worry, but I have atrophy. Yeah, I, I have no way to pick you up, so... Alright. This is life now. This guy has perseverance, I guess. Fuck, how do I... How do I get this on? Oh, overpower! Yeah, yeah! Because I'm beast, I'm so good at this game. Oh and god, you do... removed his 300 armor. Congratulations. No, it's because, like, otherwise I wouldn't be able to get his armor down low enough. Okay. Beast does not do a lot of damage. Ah, fuck. Yeah, I'll just go walk up and take a hit. Yep, yep. Because <laughs> I didn't get a turn to buff my incarnate, so that's this is what we do now. It's life. Hey, look, he's going to Sabeel! Oh, good. Sabeel's got this shit. Alright. Some, some dinner for Sabeel. Oh, that's it for that. Uh, alright, so what's the plan now? I mean, I can Phoenix dive in the middle of the room. One sec. 
Okay, don't want to hit anyone here. Alright. Uh, eat reflection. Delay. No. <laughs> I crippled. What the fuck is he fucking? I'm gonna. I'm going. Oh. I'm just going even further beyond. What you're seeing now is my normal incarnate champion. Does he really need all those buffs? <laughs> like, yes! That's the question I ask. This is my fury and my anger. Buff him more, I don't care. Do it! <laughs> I don't care for wasting turns and da -da 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 -da. Eat shit! You're wasting turns and eating the things that you normally do? Yeah. Hey, yeah. <laughs> the Akata jump is in full armor again? Shit. All right. I just like fortified him all the way back up. Uh, I'm trying to think of what to do here. You can go whichever one you want to go for. I'll go for this one. My name is not important. You in the wall? Uh, no. I'm, I, no, I'm it's because it's a little. Uh, from my like, I was looking from the other perspective, but, like it looked like you're in the wall. Looks like I'm gonna challenge this guy. Oh, dude, I reaper horned him. Amazing. He <laughs> <Ruben Zaylin. laughs> <laughs> This character has been challenged to death by the Red Prince. It's fucking on. You don't get a turn. <laughs> My assassinate, bro. What I, so I got Challenge my health. One. Yeah, I got my health back. Well, what else is it? What else does the buff mean? Oh, my uh, physical you... armor went up a little bit too. Oh, you're also getting a little bit of health back. Damage, fifteen. Oh shit, that's actually cool. I just want to know what that did, honestly. Well, I guess I guess I guess you need my help with that guy. So, all right, he's only great right. breath. You're so good. I wish I could be good like you. No, I was giving you the glory, it's fine. Might not kill him. <laughs> uh, just not enough damage. Probably should've just hit him. <laughs> That's fine, it was a setup for this. Come to me. Oh, you hit fucking... Beast. He got his name right! Into the dark with you. Oh, fuck, sorry, dwarf. Sorry. Sorry. Alright, let's go, uh... Let's go fucking... You know what, it was, it was your kill, you wanna go loot the fucking I boss? You come for me again. No, I'm calling to Sahela. I know you do. I know I only have to wait. Did we know this person from Fort Joy? Because apparently we knew this person yes, from Fort Joy. Yes, she okay. is. Who, who was she? Just she was in the cave. Oh yeah, you're right. Oh cave. yeah, the permanently blind fucker. I remember that. Um, ask how she escaped from Fort Joy. My people come for me. My mother. Sarius, the others, they take me away from there. But then the wolves come. Roost Anlon. He takes me and they cannot stop him. Undo his bl uh, binds. You should get out of here before more lone wolves show up. Do we return now? To the others? My people wait for me nearby. Uh... What should we say? Well, we did meet this. our people. Uh, yeah, you met our people and you promised to return her to them. Yes, yes, thank you. I see you so clearly. I see the goodness in you. Let's go. I guess she's following. Hey, you got a you got a summon now. <laughs> I actually do. Leader in sight. Oh uh, yeah, can I pickpocket her? Or no, I can examine. All right, so it's part from saying it to you. Well, let's see here. Oh yeah, we got the little boy. We gotta talk to the little boy. Well, there's also the fuck. There's like a ton of like kids in here. The fuck. This really is like Kevin Spacey's apartment. The fuck. He's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I guess this means I can leave. I hope the next place is better. This was a bad place. Bye, and 
Thanks. All right. You made the bad man go away. You did it. He can't hurt me now. The child smiles a ghostly gap-toothed grin and waves goodbye. Apparently we're, they're free now. Right, I'm gonna take the soul of this, uh, this doggo. Good, I was just finished looting him. Oh, it's a chew toy, don't forget that. Nah, I'm good. I'm gonna keep talking to the if ghost. If I could give you the biggest hug in the world, I'd give you the even bigger one. I love you. The fuck? Dude, this is incredibly creepy, because you, you know what this implies, right? <laughs> the spirits of a bunch of dead kids around, you know? He's gone. It doesn't hurt anymore. You did it. You saved me from the bad man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Uh, a landscape. I'll pick that up. You know, so, so, something just in case you are uh, you decide to betray me. So <laughs> You can hold it hostage, Jake. Hey. <laughs> What's the matter? I can interact with the stag head. Hey, stop that. The stag's head watches over the room. It's black eyes wide maybe and spiel? thinking. Huh? What, what, what about spiel? It's, it's like, why can we interact with the stag if we didn't want to do anything with it? Oh, wait, wait, that's right. There's a bunch of disembodied foot and, and shit on the ground. Unidentified flesh. We can do that too. I saw those before, but they were like, I would have had to steal them. So I was like, oh, I guess we're just going to leave it here. Was there anything on the, um... Oh, wait, he's there still, actually. Roost out I didn't see him. All right, let's go talk to him. The spirit's chest heaves in short, hard bursts. Its face is pinched into a tight sneer, fists balled up at its sides. It falls to its knees and grabs its matted hair in two fists, then rips. The spectral mats break away and reappear. Uh, say if he's done carrying on, you need to, uh, you need to answer some questions. Shove your questions. Swallow nails, you. 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 Uh, tell him, tell him you need to know who ordered him to kill Sans. <sighs> Does it matter? They won't stop. Not till they're all dead. You can be sure of that. They ain't. What do you think? They'll do anything to survive. You'll get what's coming to you. The good guy. Everyone's their own good guy. Who gave him the contract to kill Void uh, Godwoken, sorry. Uh, God, not Voidwoken, Godwoken. He catches a string of spittle with the back of his hand and wipes it away as a malevolent grin spreads over his face. God did. Do us all a favor. And go duck. He scratches oh. at his scarred face with spectral nails, digging deep grooves that instantly vanish. No. No, no. Oh, you can talk to him with FN, see see if anything changes. Yeah, I had that. It I had falls that to its knees and grabs its matted <clears throat> hair in two fists. <laughs> I'll ask him to answer questions, I guess. <laughs> you can't watch him like fucking I think it, like you said, you did the first. You did. You asked some questions. When, oh, sure, last guy asked questions. Why don't? I wonder if you have different questions. No, you don't have different questions. He catches a string right. of spittle with the back of his hand and wipes it oh, away. Oh, I want to eat some shit with Sabiel. Spreads over his face. Well, that's actually a fucking glowy crossbow she has. All right, let's see. Just embodied hand. You are running, running, running through a barren landscape. Brambles and weeds scratch at your ankles. Your heart is pumping acid, but you can't stop. Something catches you around the chest and you fall. The rough ground scrapes burns into the flesh of your bare arms, your knees, your face, you as you skid to a stop. Footsteps approach. That's the scion, a rough voice calls. Kill him. Me. Ah, uh, that's just a regular snack. They tried to hide you. They put you in a cellar. They put you in a cave. They put you in the hills. They put you in a pit. In the end, Roost found you anyway. He tried to find your memories by drilling a hole in your skull. It didn't work, but you were finally free. You are a young elf, very young. Still, the memories of Ian's dance inside you. You watch them like a play behind your eyelids. You are asleep in your family home when Roost's people steal in like a plague. 
a hand over your mouth, a hurried journey through the forests. You won't tell Roost how to find the others. The end comes quick. All right. Well, do we want to just teleport her away for, with us, I guess? Well, let's check out the black mirror first. Oh, yeah, that's true. All right. The surface of the mirror ripples with a sickly haze. As you gaze into its surface, the haze forms shapes, and the shapes jerk into a figure. You see the outline of a skull, perhaps once an elf, though the flesh is all but rotted from his bones. What remains is the flat, dull color of sick. Behind him march ornately clad black ring. The picture flickers, fades, then returns in full relief. Beneath the din of the marching soldiers, or perhaps alongside it, a voice snags in your mind, like a fishhook in an open eye. It makes a demand. Tell it if you killed another Godwoken. Uh, report that yes, you did indeed. The image strains and flickers again. Each time it comes into focus, an odd sensation tickles your head, like a small, many-legged creature were trying to wriggle its way in through your ear. The image flickers and fades to a hazy sheen once more, and the sensation vanishes. The rare prey. Uh, we looked into a mirror made of dark glass, found ourselves communing with what seemed to be a hideously disfigured elf. Huh. The haze swirled. Okay. Well, let's go talk to each other. There's no denying what you saw. The <laughs> black ring itself is hunting you, or at least paying others to do so. No time for it's idle to chat. It's impossible to tell who might be working for them. You eye your companions. Well, as a lone wolf with a standing contract to kill Godwoken. I trust you. I suppose even a king has to put some trust in his subjects. Let that part let that be our party line then. Money makes blind. I wonder how many of you can still see the light of day. Only thing to do is keep your friends close. So close you'll be able to whip out a short blade in time. If they look at you funny. So wait, our, our companions disagreed with us? I guess. Fuck them. Alright. I think we could take Beast and Zabil. That's fine. <laughs> Alright, I'm ready. Let's do Wait, this. no, I, I'd, be real, I'd die. <laughs> no, you have your fucking, you have your minions. Alright, I have to end the episode soon, but I, I want to see if I can take her with me. Or whatever the fuck her name is. So you want to just, like, do a what, what waypoint out? Yeah, I was thinking of, uh, where do I want to go to? Paradise Downs? We continue. Oh right, yeah, here we go. We go on. You have earned the hero tag. Uh, Sibyl earned the hero tag. Take your nod and leave. Alright, she's gone now. She's free now. I'm still on the sawmill, but uh, do you want me to come follow you? I mean, I don't know. I, I'll just maybe come back. She's free, so it's all good. So it just says we... Like, like I don't think that's actually supposed to happen. I think we're supposed to bring her out, like normally but for some reason the devs left it in that they follow you to waypoints because it's like instantly fucking free uh all right so what did your what did your quest say for yourself by the way your story so far what happened with it since we killed that guy just curious um why does it say story so far wolf alone well, because I have... Okay, so, like, I go into my quest line, and there's Redemption, the Red Prince, and then it says, like, I met with Sada, the Red Princess, and we, we fucked each other and things like that. So what does it say for you? Did it update? Nothing about this. Really? Oh, no he, update? He, he's not a part of... Oh, because he's... Uh, is he not a part of your quest? I guess not. I guess it was just Sabil's fucking party, then. Alright, if we go outside, will everyone want to kill us? Uh, the answer is Yes. Yes, they do. Do we want to kill them? Are their names important is the question. I, I kind of want to go see what the other guy had. I mean, I don't know. It's up to you. Paladin Bridgehead. I don't know. We don't well, this guy's chill with us, apparently. I don't know. I, I, I'm going to go maybe check out the... Uh... We should get moving soon. This place might be as safe as it looks. The fuck? Why am I not allowed over there? Uh, I also want to check out something else. Ah, oh, fuck it. We'll do it next episode. All right, guys. Peace. We're out. We're out. Skis. We will love you and all that. I guess I'll just stay right here, and then we'll just begin the next episode from here. Goodbye.